Привет, it's Irkutska. Hey, I made it to Irkutsk after a long, tiring flight on a plane with basically no leg space. I uh, didn't sleep at all, but that's okay, uh, because now I'm here. So, how do you get here to Yakutsk? Well, basically, you have two choices. From Moscow, you will need about uh, five to six hours to come here by plane. And then the other option is going by train. So, train rides from Moscow will take you four to five days. Yeah. <laughs> But still, yeah, it's definitely worth the experience and the views on the way are incredible. So if you have the time, I definitely prefer the train and yeah, I can highly recommend that. I can almost feel you walk, walk, walking in the distance, but I know that is not real. thing about Yakutsk are the super tiny houses like look at those windows they're reaching to the ground and you find many 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 of them all over the city and yeah just like this one they're tiny they're so cute <laughs> some of them have been doors where I definitely wouldn't fit through admittedly I'm not small uh -uh, but yeah, maybe you can see it in here wait show it to you yeah so here you can see both the doors So, how would you explore the city? Well, basically, it's quite easy. In the city, you find a green line going all around the city and you just follow that line. That's it. The line uh, covers a total of five kilometers and goes by nearly all of the biggest attractions of the city. Just follow that line that you've seen it all, except for Kazan Church. Unfortunately, I won't make it on this trip, but just for reference, that you won't miss out, look for this building right here. So, is it quite easy to just jump on the next plane and go to Russia? Unfortunately, it's not. You have to get a visa first, at least if you're a EU citizen, and you can only get that at an embassy or a consulate. Yeah, another reason why you should be coming to Irkutsk is probably this church here. Uh, it's called uh, Saviour's Church. Don't ask me about the Russian name, I tried to look it up. Wait, actually, I'm gonna look it up. Um, Spasaya Tserkov. That was probably a wonderful Russian. Yeah, Saviour's Church. Uh, it's just as beautiful inside as it is outside. Unfortunately, you can't film in there, so you gotta come here by yourself and check it out. It's worth it, I can tell you that. Yeah, that's it actually for today um, of my little tour around Irkutsk. I know it was kind of river-based mostly, but that's, in my opinion, the most beautiful part about this city. And in the city, you find many, many more small places around. Make sure you check them out. Uh, yeah, if you want to see the vid upcoming videos from my colleague, subscribe. And that's it for today. Thank you and goodbye.